Thanks for taking the time to help me study, teacher. You're a lifesaver. Hmm? Where's Tia? Oh, she texted me while I was on my way over here. Uh, apparently she had something she had to take care of. She didn't say what, but it seemed like it was important. So, it looks like it's just the two of us. Is that okay? <laughs> Let's get started then. You see, I'm having trouble with these types of problems. I plug the numbers into the formula like I'm supposed to, but I never get the right answer. I can't for the life of me figure out what I'm doing wrong. Oh. I see. Then I'm supposed to do it like this? Is this correct? You're a lot better at explaining things than the other teachers. You actually see me as a student, so you take your time to go through everything. You don't speak too fast or mumble, and you make sure to stop every so often to make sure I really understand everything. Studying doesn't feel like so much of a chore when you're the one doing the teaching. Although, I have to wonder, does teaching ever feel like a chore to you? After all, you have to understand the subjects a lot better than your students do. And then you have to make sure you're explaining in a manner your students can understand. There's no way to hide even the slightest gap in your knowledge. It must be stressful. Hmm. Teaching someone else something cements it in your mind better. Then, if I taught Tia what we just went over, I'd remember it even better for the test. Hmm. I'll give it a try then. Thank you, teacher. Before we move on to the next subject, teacher, have you been getting enough rest lately? It doesn't seem like it. You look really tired. While I worked on the problems you assigned to me earlier, I noticed you dozing off in your chair. Honestly, I thought it was cute, so I didn't say anything. I feel really bad, though. You have a lot of important work to do, after all. I'm sure it gets stressful from time to time. I'm sorry. I should have been more mindful. I don't want you to push yourself because of me. You're okay? You don't seem like it at all. Just look at the backs under your eyes. And your skin is so pale, too. I'm sorry. I didn't need to get too close like that. Oh? So, you've been having trouble sleeping? I thought so. I bet there's a lot on your mind every day. It might be hard to empty your mind and when you finally have to get some rest. Hmm. Teacher? Have you heard about ASMR? Yes, it's a style of video that's pretty popular. Sometimes, when I have trouble falling asleep, I listen to these kinds of videos and it really puts me at ease. The other day, Tia said I have the perfect voice for ASMR. Mm. She said if I started making videos, I'd get really popular. I'm not too sure about that, but... If it'll help you relax, I'll be more than happy to give it a try. If that's okay with you, teacher. It is. Then 
and to start, how about you sit somewhere comfortable? Yeah, there's fine. Now, hmm, do you have any cotton socks that I can borrow? What for? Well, you'll see. They're in the bathroom. <laughs> Give me a second. Okay, I'm back. Now, I'll get right behind you. Close your eyes and take a deep breath for me, okay? This feel nice. To be honest, I'm just copying what I've seen and heard in the videos. It's pleasant to the ears when there's the disconnect of you hearing it through a pair of headphones. I'm not so sure if it's nice in person. If you don't like it, let me know, okay? You do like it? I'm glad. You know, you're not really supposed to clean your ears like this, but it does feel really nice, and it should be fine as long as you're careful. I'll make sure I don't shove the cotton swab in too deep. I don't know what I'd do if I ended up hurting you. You trust that I wouldn't? Mm, well, Nikkei's can't hurt humans anyways. Although, I'm not sure if injuries caused by ear cleaning would count. Teacher, do you want me to take care of the other ear now? Alright. popular kind of ASMR? Mm, I'd say so. There's lots of ear cleaning videos online. I think people like it because it feels nice to be taken care of. Cleaning your ears is such a mundane thing you do on your own every day, but if someone were to take the time to do it for you, then I suppose it makes you feel cherished and safe. And that's how I feel when I listen to those kinds of videos anyway. Oh, what do you think, teacher? How does me cleaning your ears make you feel? Does it feel nice? I'm glad. Here. Always doing so much for me. It makes me happy that I can do something for you for once, even if it is something so small. 
It's not small at all. Mm. I see. So you really did need this. I knew you were overworked. Teacher, I can keep studying on my own, so if you want to rest on my lap just a little bit longer, I wouldn't mind. Mm -hmm. Please go ahead. No, it's not uncomfortable at all. I promise I'll get lots of work done while you sleep. So, you just get as much rest as you need, okay? Good. Sweet dreams, teacher. 